So we've arrived in El Nido. Windy roads. Three and a half hour ride. Went if you to... get travel sick, yeah, I would advise travel sickness tablets. Oh yes, yeah. <laughs> but the road's okay. pretty good, yeah. yeah. Someone left their um, shoes on top of the bus. And they flew off. Flew off, so we ended up reversing down the main road. Um, to get them. Yeah, so Keep fairly dangerous. And then we drove a little bit further, and then someone else said, oh, I've got my shoes on the roof, can I stop? So we stopped, and we nearly got whacked up the arse by a bus. Anyway, we're in El Nido. And in we're gonna, one piece. In one piece, just about. Um, and it's bloody El Scorchio. So we've arrived at El Nido Beach and there's nobody else here. And it's quite small actually. Yeah, it's a lot smaller than I thought. I think Port Barton Beach is bigger than this. It's a lot bigger. Yeah, yeah I was expecting it to be a lot bigger than this. Yeah. It's very beautiful with the limestone sort of crags oh, yeah, coming over. But it's empty, but people do say that. Yeah, they say... Everyone's gone out yeah. on the boat chores during the day. Yeah, and, so uh, it's a bit dead. Yeah, there's nothing it's like ghost town. Yeah. It's all right. So everyone's coming to the Philippines. Yeah. Everyone's coming to El Nido and the beach is quiet. Just tells me that they're only coming to El Nido for the boat tours. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, so I wouldn't want to swim in the sea in El Nido Beach anyway. You know, people say it's dirty here and that's the first impression you get. Yeah, there's actually. crap all on the beach. Yeah. Shame, because it's a very beautiful place. Yeah, it is. So if you thought Port Barton was dear, think again <laughs> we've just seen a beer here for 250 pesos oh, no. what's that about it's four quid that's or something tourism, bloody guys. hell that's you can get them cheaper in the uk so yeah there's some beautiful views from the restaurants yeah cracking yeah eh? beautiful <laughs> yeah and beautiful prices as well but um <laughs> especially considering we've spent a bit of time in manila Manila, I like oh, Manila prices. I really like Manila, yeah. But this is, I mean, you know why people come in. Money is coming to El Nido. Oh, completely. Yeah. It feels so much different. Like, I mean, Port Barton. Just give it a little wipe. Is, um, you can tell they're preparing for the boom there, but yeah. this is obviously already happened. They reckon they're putting the four lane motorway in Palawan. Yeah, That's what they're Red, extending to. Yeah, the Airbnb host was telling yeah. us, wasn't she? That's incredible. This, this island, you know. Yeah. Are they prepared? So we've just arrived in Odessa Mama, which is a traditional Ukrainian restaurant. Who would have thought our last destination was Ukraine? We've arrived in the Philippines and found a Ukrainian restaurant. So that was a Dessa Mama. Yeah. <laughs> Bit of a letdown, guys. We need to go back and try the beer. The beer is supposed to be good. As a standalone thing. Yeah, because Ukraine are famous for their beers. Yes. And to find one in the Philippines, probably be good. Yeah. Um, the food side. The food wasn't good, guys. No. Uh, the Baron Yankee with um, curdled sour cream. Curdled sour cream. We had the Daruni, which are pancakes. Soggy because they were drowned Soggy. in curdled sour cream. And we had a cold rice. Oh no. What they trying to do? Kill us? We've only just arrived. <laughs> I'm 
So I've just gone to another dirty ice cream cart. Mango this time guys, 10 pesos. The cheapest thing in El Nido. And that's probably lovely. Mm. So, fake aviator ray bands I've just seen for 1,300 pesos. Ooh. They're 200 pesos in Makati. Yes. There's just construction work going on everywhere here, guys. Yeah, apparently around four years ago there was two shops and, and a few places to stay. Yeah, and there was just palm trees here. Now there's millions of shops and millions of hotels and loads more going up. And cost millions of pounds. <laughs> Is El Nido open for business or what? Crazy. So nothing's got a price on it here. Um, no. And when you ask what the price <laughs> is, you're always getting a different um, price every time. answer, yeah. I just yeah. took something, well, I had a price on it and they start, they tried to charge me more. <laughs> Funny. El Nido. What are you El doing to, Nido. What are you doing to us, man? Take us back to Port Barton. Yeah. That is so nice. Talk about a rip-off, guys. <laughs> oh um, we've just gone to the t-shirt shop. Uh, T-shirts are very good quality. Yeah. Um, probably grade A copies, what you can get in Manila. Yes. 71 euro. That Very is much? unbelievable. <laughs> 71 euro. We're not lying. We've just seen this t-shirt. That's a Lacoste t-shirt. Just a t-shirt though. 71, 71 euro. euro they're trying to charge us. Bloody crazy, hell. Isn't it, really? If you think you're coming to the Philippines to save money, don't come to El Nido. Don't come to El Nido. <laughs> so we're all dressed up, ready for the canopy walk here in El Nido. Definitely do the canopy walk when in El Nido. Even if you're shit scared of heights. Yes, well worth the view. It's 400 pesos each, but it's definitely worth it for the view. And the yes, view is stunning. beautiful. I have lost my body weight in water about you 10 do times look then. <laughs> yeah, all that Actually. water I've lost. Maybe I should come to El Nido more often. Yeah, it's like one of those. Um, like a detox. Boxes that do it, don't they wrap themselves in cling film yeah. and they sweat? Yeah. yeah. We're on a proper Please detox wait. here, guys. Yeah. Um, yes, so... Taro... is it Taro? Taro, I think. I'm not sure. Taro Cliff. Canopy viewpoint. When in El Nido. Must. <laughs> so, guys, just come back for a costume change. And this is why. Here's my T-shirt. Wait for it, guys. Can you see this? Not yet. Oh, yes. Meow. <laughs> I have never sweated this much in my life. You look like you've just been in the sea, love. Yes, I may as well have been. We're back. El Nido. It's good for your pores, they reckon, sweating. Come to El Nido. De-cleanse. So guys, we've just turned up at Karong Karong. Now this is more like it, El This Nido. is more like it, yeah. Oh wow. This is beautiful here, look at the this. The beach is nice and clean. It isn't swamped by 
people. Lots of Westerners <laughs> like us. Looks like you still get your boat tours here. Yeah, you can still get boat tours here. There's a few section of restaurants. And it's just sh- just a short walk south of El Nido oh, Town. Oh, literally. 10, 15 minutes? 15 minutes, reckon? yeah. Look at this. So, El Nido. Paradise or hellhole? Both. Paradise pa- and hellhole. Yeah, agree. <laughs> Paradise and hellhole. El Nido town, hellhole. Overpriced, yeah. dirty. Um, crammed with people. Crammed with people. Quality of restaurants, bad. Caron, Caron. Caron, Caron. Ten minutes walk south. Yeah, and uh, Las Cabanas Beach. Peaceful, clean. Yeah. Cheaper. Stunning scenery. So paradise. Should you come to El Nido? Yes. Of course you should. If you yeah. want to, get your butts here. Yeah, come and see for yourself. Yeah. And get here soon because Karong Karong will probably be a hell hole in a few years' time. Yeah. Because there is building work everywhere. Yeah, everywhere. So, yeah. come, make your own decision. Yeah. And if you just want to do the boat tours, this is the Mecca, guys. This definitely is. Yeah. But be prepared to be swimming with about 5,000 other people. Yeah. If you like that sort of thing, you'll love El Nido. Mm-hmm.